Steven Garner here. Welcome to Next Q. I'm going to share with you my five cues that will help you to stay sane during this pandemic. Number one, don't quit your purpose. In a time of crisis, conflict, difficult circumstances, financial hardship, you should never quit your purpose. Actually, you should use those opportunities to refine your purpose because you're all, you are always going to deal with difficult times, no matter what. And so you want to use the hardship to bring out those things that are areas of weakness or areas of improvement during the crisis. Because sometimes you don't know who you are until you are in controversy or conflict or a difficult situation. Number two, you got to live in the right now right now. You can't focus on tomorrow. Don't imagine tomorrow being worse than it is today. Most of the things that we imagine never really happen to us. That's the improper use of your imagination anyway. You need to focus on the right now. Use yesterday as a reference, but right now is when you have the biggest opportunity to plan, prepare, and enjoy the peace that you have. Number three, you got to be creative. I'm a creative guy. I've been doing this for decades now. <laughs> and the one thing I find people fail to do is in times of difficulty is be creative. You know, they say invention is the mother of necessity. Most of the greatest inventions were born out of necessity. And so you have to take time to look, observe, work the angles and see what opportunity you have to invent something, create something, or even just do something to bring joy into someone else's life through your creativity. Number four, be generous. Listen, multiple people are hurting right now. In fact, I've been giving money to as many people that I can afford to give. I've even been looking for opportunities to give people money through Cash App, PayPal, and other sources because it could be you. And so being generous is about helping other people to live. Giving is living, as they say. Don't be selfish. Don't hoard. Don't keep things to yourself. Just keep what you need and help someone else. That's the beautiful thing about being in America, man. We help each other to be great and to succeed. Um, number five, you have to stay connected, okay? You gotta stay connected with people. And I know that we have to social distance and you know, there are certain things, and I do agree with that, by the way, okay? <laughs> but you can connect through technology, you can connect um, through many other ways that you can't do humanly. But this is going to teach us not to take each other for granted, all right? So what I do every day, I establish a routine of these things that I just mentioned to you. I get up in the morning, I exercise, you know, after I have my meditation and prayer, um, I go to work, and then I set aside time deliberately to connect with people, to do those things that I just mentioned, to be generous, to be creative. I have a schedule. This keeps me sane every day, during this pandemic. Listen, those are my cues. And I want to encourage you to stay focused on your purpose. Don't quit. You know, live in the right now. Be creative. Be generous and stay connected. Listen, take your cues from me and live a great life. Next cue.